Would you sign up for a trip to Mars even though it's a one-way ticket? A UNM student says he's ready to go after being selected as a finalist. Tonight he told Action 7 News reporter Laura Train why he is willing to leave Earth. Over 200,000 people applied for just 40 seats on the Mars One mission. A New Mexico native, Zach Gallegos, just learned he's one of only 100 finalists. When I got the email, I was really, really happy. I, I jumped up and down a few times. As a graduate student of planetary and Earth science here at the University of New Mexico, Gallegos has experience working with the Mars rover. He's always wanted to be an astronaut, but the Mars One mission is very different from anything any human has ever attempted. It's a one way ticket to another planet. We asked Gallegos if he had any apprehension about never returning to Earth. I've thought about not going, but that worries me more than going. So I'm going. Mars's atmosphere is 95% carbon dioxide. It can get extremely cold at night, and the only water on the planet is in the form of ice lurking underground. Like frozen aquifers? Mm hmm. And eventually, if Mars ever warmed up again, uh, these poles might, you know, lose all their water and it would go to this area, which is an ocean. But Gallegos tells me he's not too worried about whether Mars can support life. He says it's just a stepping stone to reaching other solar systems that might have planets like Earth. And even if he doesn't make the final cut, he says he's going to find a way to get to space. Laura Turan, KOAT, Action 7 News. The launch is scheduled for 2024. Gallegos said he is not sure what the next step in the application process is. The last thing he was told was to wait for further instructions.